E aí galera, sejam bem-vindos ao canal Dash Games e vamos continuando aqui nossa aventura em Dragon Quest 11. Partiu? Vamos lá então. Temos algo aqui atrás. Ou não? Eu acho que era a exclamação na cabeça desse cara aqui. Temos muitas coisas similares com Dragon Ball, né galera? Afinal, é o mesmo criador dos personagens. Então as características estão embutidas aí. Certo, aqui nós temos algumas coisas para comprar, né? Temos um baú aqui. Aqui é para nós dormirmos. Beleza. Geralmente, galera, essas lojinhas aqui vendem itens únicos. Toda lojinha que você vê tem alguma coisinha aqui que geralmente é único. Talvez essa lunária aqui, ó. E a maioria dessas coisinhas é necessário para forjar algum tipo de equipamento. É a dica que eu dou a vocês, fiquem ligados nisso. Bom, eu vou arriscar e subir por aqui. Tô achando que o caminho é esse. Caraca, mas tá complexo isso daqui, hein? Meu Deus. Temos alguns livros aqui, ó. É sempre importante lê-los. Eles podem revelar receitas de novos equipamentos. Ou manuscritos, né? Receita fica meio estranha. Ok, não temos nada. Feito. Mas é um lugarzinho bem aconchegante. Meu, eu tô perdido, sério mesmo. Eu vou continuar subindo aqui. Mais cedo ou mais tarde nós vamos chegar em algum lugar. Deve ser aqui. Ok, não temos nada, então vamos lá. Once again to Anguilla, honored luminary. As I believe you know, it is my privilege to serve as High Lama of this most sacred temple. I am to address you as Your Holiness, correct? Might I ask what you and your people know of my companion? Why everything, of course. We have awaited his coming ever since the day he entered this world, in the castle of Dundrasil. Waiting for him? What do you mean? I mean exactly what I say, nothing more. Tell me, do you recognize the symbol on this banner? It is the emblem of Dundrasil. Since the age of heroes, the princes of that nation have come here to train with us for six years of their youth. Your young friend was born a Prince of Dundrasil. Thus do we expect him to come here as a boy and study under the great Grand Master Pang. Sadly, that was not to be. So if fate had been kinder, you would have spent a good part of your childhood here. What of his tutor, this Grand Master Pang you speak of? When the Lord of Shadows brought the World Tree low, the Master set out to summon a magical mandala to protect the temple from destruction. The spell succeeded, but its power was too great. Grand Master Pang did not return. A noble sacrifice indeed. Now that the Master is gone, it falls to me to guide you. Come to the Field of Discipline. It lies behind this hall. There is something you must see. It is a shame that the Grand Master cannot be here. I would have liked to meet one so noble. Come, let us see what His Holiness has in store. Ok, 
Será que temos algo aqui? Ou será que é esse o caminho? Acho que não, hein? Mas não custa nada darmos uma olhada aqui. Deve ter algo aqui. Beleza. Vamos nesse daqui. Ok, vamos voltar lá. Deixa eu dar uma olhada do lado esquerdo. Estranho, não temos nada. Vamos descer aqui. Ok. Vamos lá. Ô, oh, cidadezinha legal, hein? Muito bem trabalhada. Beyond those doors lies the field of discipline, where students of Anguilla strive for enlightenment. Before we tread upon this hallowed ground, let me tell you a little of our history. And of the luminary of legend himself, Erdwin. Before setting out to defeat the Dark One, Erdwin came to our temple to learn from the Wise Ones, who made their homes here even then. The first Grand Master, Ayi, accepted him as a disciple and trained him in the secrets of spiritual realization. But he did not train alone. During his time here, he met someone, someone who would change his fate forever. Who was this person? Another of Ayi's disciples. A young mage whose talent outshone that of all who had come before. A man named Morkant. Erdwin and Morkant were trained together every day, each striving to outstrip the other. Though they were fierce rivals, they became firm friends. When their training was complete, Morkant joined with Erdwin in his quest to slay the Dark One. Without Morkant's magic, He might never have prevailed. Before setting out, they carved an inscription into this stone, a pledge of eternal friendship. It has been a treasure of ours ever since. Morkan. I have not heard the name before. Now allow me to show you to the field of discipline. If you would be so good as to follow me, Ok, vamos lá então. Welcome to the field of discipline. Since the age of heroes, many a would-be warrior has spilled sweat and blood upon these flagstones. If your karma had been different, this is where you would have trained under Grand Master Pang, like all the princes of Dundrasil before you. I have brought you here so that you might stand in the footsteps of your ancestors. An unbroken line leading all the way back to the Age of Heroes. Even your grandfather, Lord Robert, completed his training here. The memory of his achievements shall live long in the temple's memory. His achievements? <clears throat> Pang was a harsh master. With this implement, disciples whose efforts were lacking were given motivation directly to their fundament. It became known as the Naughty Stick. During the course of his six years of tuition, your grandfather's right honorable posterior was paddled an unprecedented 10,000 times. The tale of Lord Robert's road to enlightenment lives on to this day. Every disciple knows that he must focus at all times, lest he face the same fate. A legendary achievement indeed. You are worried for your grandfather, yes? 
do not be. Lord Robert overcame every challenge set for him by the Grand Master and emerged stronger every time. The fall of the World Tree would not have been enough to extinguish one so resilient. He is alive. I sense it. Tonight there will be a modest feast in the High Hall to celebrate your long-awaited arrival. We would be greatly honoured if you would join us. We may not be able to aid you as we would have done were Master Pang still with us, but in this respect at least we can provide. Isso aí. Awake at last, hmm? It is high time we were on our way. If the Grand Master was still alive, perhaps we might have learned something to help us in our fight against the Lord of Shadows. Sadly, it was not to be. Galera, isso é muito bom. Uma parte que eu destaco é que o Reb também passou por aqui e tomou 10 mil patadas. Caraca, viu? Bom, vamos descer por aqui. Estou gostando muito do lado que essa história está indo. E o Hermit? O que news de ele? Forgive us, Your Holiness. Os monstros na the mountain path were too strong. We were unable to reach him. I see. Your Holiness, is there a problem? Yes, Sir Hendrik. I fear there is. You see, two weeks ago a hermit visited us, unannounced, then just as suddenly departed for the top of the mountain. Hello? Whatever for? That I do not know. The moment he heard that Master Pang had passed away, He ran from the temple. He was last seen climbing the path to the summit. The mountain has become infested with monsters, emboldened and strengthened by the rise of the Lord of Shadows. It is a perilous place indeed. This being so, I dispatched a group of disciples to return him to safety. As you can see, things did not go quite as planned. I have trained all my life for a moment such as this, and yet I have failed in my first true test. I have brought shame upon Angrila. Might we be able to offer some assistance? I thank you for your kindness, but you are guests here. I cannot ask you to undertake such a dangerous task. A knight of Heliodor does not abandon an innocent in need. These people have shown us great kindness. It is only right that we do them a kindness in return. Would you not agree? Thank you from the bottom of my heart. But I cannot allow you to bear this burden alone. I shall come with you. We must depart for the summit of Mount Pang Lai without delay. After exiting the temple, we will take the path to the east in order to begin our ascent. É isso aí então. Uma boa ação para o dia. O pessoal foi muito cordial, então vamos retribuir um pouco, né? Vamos ver aqui. Acho que nós temos que descer lá para a parte de baixo e subir para o Monte Peng Lei. Bora lá então, vamos descer por aqui, temos uma quest, não vou fazê-la agora, tá, vamos descer por este caminho, lugar muito bem trabalhado, hein galera, ok, vamos dar uma olhada aqui, quem sabe temos alguns jarros ou alguma coisa assim, certo, não temos, 
É de fato, eu acho que eu vou descer lá pra baixo mesmo Vamos diretamente pro objetivo Ok Esse caminho aqui mesmo É, vamos lá Perfeito Então toda a nossa linhagem fez treinamentos aqui Que legal, hein? Bom, nós viemos ali da base da caverna E agora vamos pra esquerda aqui mesmo. No caso, para a direita de onde estamos olhando. É aqui mesmo, né? Ok, só vou dar uma olhadinha por este lado aqui. Provavelmente teremos algum tipo de item. E aí sim, vamos continuar para valer. Vamos ver aqui. Beleza. Bora lá então. Partiu. Vamos lá, cara. Vamos ver aqui. Oh, meu Deus do céu, coisa linda. Esse daqui eu vou ter que pegar, não tem jeito. Com calma aí, amigão. Você tá muito nervoso. E falou. Beleza. E agora vamos voar. Partiu. Beleza. Mais um dragãozinho aqui. Vamos ver se temos algum item por este canto aqui. Eu vou explorar primeiro esse lado aqui. É. Não temos nenhuma saída, só um baú. Ou temos saída ali? Será que dá pra passar aqui por baixo? Não dá não. Talvez nadando, mas não tem essa opção, né? Será que tem limite de voo aqui? O limite é até aqui. Tranquilo então, vamos continuando. Vamos lá, vamos lá. Maravilha. Corre. Oh, meu Deus, corre. Perfeito. Chegamos ao topo. Essa musiquinha é boa demais. Eu vou até dar uma salvadinha aqui. O jogo salvo partiu. Hmm. It seems we are too late. Is this the hermit we came in search of? Unfortunately so. He was in deep meditation when he breathed his last. I am glad at least that he was prepared to meet his fate. But that posture, it is awful, uniquely awful. I know it from somewhere. Incredible! Issue one of the Ogler's Digest. And in mint condition. <laughs> é só Deus na causa. 
<clears throat> ah, indeed. It seems our friend here made his peace with the world before departing. This, at least, is some small solace. <clears throat> But this... This is one of the royal treasures of Dundrasil. Why would a lowly hermit have such a... <gasps> a skies! Can it really be? Lord Robert! Caraca, é o Reb? Com essa revistinha aí do lado, hein? Safadinho. Your grandfather was Master Pang's most fervent disciple. Can he have chosen to follow his mentor to the next life, perhaps? No, he is still breathing. What? His spirit hovers in the place between life and death. It is only a matter of time before he passes the point of no return. But there may yet be a way to save him. If you were to follow him into the void, you might be able to bring him back. But how? Is this even possible? The ancient teachings tell us that the summit of Mount Pang Lai stands at the crossroads between this world and the next. If you will permit me, I can perform an ancient rite that will send you to the place between worlds. But it is not a decision to be taken lightly. Once that place is entered, there is no guarantee of return. Well, will you take that chance? Will you visit the Void and bring Lord Robert back to us? Hmm. Very well. I will prepare for the ritual. Tell me when you are ready, and we will begin. Muito bom, né, galera? Quem diria? Aquela cena da revista foi sensacional. Ele parece mais magro do que a última vez que nós o vimos. Ah, isso é claro, né? E ele tá aqui com uma cópia da revista, fotos artísticas e artigos eruditos. Haha, <risos> muito bom. Bom, galera, o restante eu vou deixar pra continuar no próximo episódio. Conto com o seu apoio deixando um joinha e compartilhando o vídeo. Nós nos vemos no próximo episódio. Um forte abraço. Valeu. Fui!